the way you can control your music on the lock screen has changed in iOS 16, so here's a quick guide to all the special new things you can do on the lock screen with your music. Well, before we can control the music, we need to play something, so I'll jump into the music app and I'll just press play on this Radiohead playlist. Now you won't be able to hear this because I don't want to get a copyright strike on YouTube, and potentially you wouldn't like to hear Radiohead anyway, but just imagine what it sounds like for me. Now we're going to go back to the lock screen, and here you're going to get what's called the Live Activity View. This is basically a Now Playing card, and here is where you can control all of your music. Now, before iOS 16, the playhead, the play bar, and the volume bar both had a little dial in the middle you could grab hold of to move, and that's gone in iOS 16. But don't worry, it still functions in the same way. You can simply tap and drag to move the song forwards and backwards, and to change the volume. But a really clever tip here is that you haven't got to be precise and find the actual part where the music has got to in the track. You can just tap and hold anywhere on that horizontal bar, and the same for volume too. Look, just like this. Okay, let's jump forward a song, and now I'm going to show you probably my favourite feature of this new music interface, and that is you can have your album artwork filling the whole screen, and your whole lock screen will change to fit the album cover you're playing. To do this, simply tap on the small album cover, and then it will fill the screen just like this. It works on music, on podcasts, on any audio that's playing, and the background colour will change as you move through songs that have different artwork. I think this looks really beautiful, but if you want to change it back, all you need to do is tap on the artwork again, and that will toggle between the small mode and the full screen mode. On here you also have the option of changing the output source of your music. For me at the moment I'm playing it to my HomePod, but if you tap on that icon you can change it to your Apple TV, your HomePod, your AirPods, anything that supports AirPlay. And perhaps you decide that you've had enough of Radiohead and you want to change your music completely. Well, there's a super quick shortcut to jump back into the music app. All you need to do is tap the name of the song, just like this.